The Greenville Swamp Rabbits are having a great <laughs> season, and we got Mark with us, Mark Shelley. We're going to be talking about actually their four games, but a big series of three games this weekend, right, Mark? Absolutely. We have three games this weekend. This is really the final weekend homestand, sure. if you will, and uh, kicking off on Thursday mm -hmm. and rolling right into Friday and then Sunday, an off Thirsty day on Thursday. Saturday. Thirsty Thursday. Yes, what does that we're mean? glad to bring that back. <laughs> uh, hey, we got sixteen. Uh, $3.16 ounce uh, Stomper Lagers and $3.12 12 ounce domestic beers. And before the puck drop, you can get $2 water and sodas at the arena. So I know fans love that. And, uh, you know, we heard we heard the fans. And, you know, Thirsty Thursday makes your weekend start off right. Yes, yeah. I love it. Talk about people, you know, is experience when they come to a game. Because there's so many times people will post like, oh, my gosh, I can't believe this is the first game we've been to. This was the most fun weekend we've had. Yeah, that, and that's what we that's what we want. We want people leaving saying one word when mm -hmm. they leave the building. Amazing. Fun. I had fun, right? Yeah. And, and that's what we're about. We're about a family-friendly entertainment and making it able to come out uh, and, and sort of be able to go to the arena and have fun at a hockey game, right? Yeah. The, the hockey game, yes, it's a, it's a great product and it's a development system, but we want you to have fun at it first right. because that's, that's what gets you to come back. That's what you want to come back, you want to yeah. come back, and ultimately you get to watch hockey at the end of the day. To watch you guys win. Mm. Are you saying after this series of three this weekend, you still have to win the fourth game to be in the playoffs? We we what are in that? a we are in a very hard playoff fight right now. We're two points back. It's uh, you know it's it's a great turnaround to this season. It, it, it was a slow start, and all of a sudden things turned around. Yeah, we've done nothing but but win games and and have great success over the second part of the season. And we put ourselves right in this playoff fight. And uh, April fifteenth, we have that game uh, fan appreciation night, final home game of the season of the regular season. That is, We're, yes. you know, playoffs. Yeah. Playoffs are, are hanging there. We're, we're fighting for them. The Orlando Solar Bears come to town. They're the team in fourth place, so it's going to be a it's going to be a hard fought match up there, and it could come down to that game. So we need all of our fans there in attendance yeah. and this fan appreciation night. What kind of things are you going to be doing? Yeah. So throughout this weekend, uh, leading up to fan appreciation night, you know we're gonna we're gonna have a, a great set of giveaways. Obviously, uh, leading up. Tomorrow, Thirsty Thursday, Friday, you're going to get some of these. I know yes. you guys were, were excited uh -huh. about these boom sticks. The first, uh, the first 1,500 fans in the building uh, get these thunder sticks thanks to the uh, Daniel Mortgage Group. And then on Sunday, uh, on our Sunday fun day, the first 750 fans get a T-shirt oh, uh, courtesy it. of Drexel Meyer. So yeah. we're really excited about that. And then fan appreciation night. Uh, that's our celebration, our way of saying thank you to the fans, welcoming mm -hmm. them into the building. Uh, having them out there for a great time, one final time to see the Rabbits. Hopefully, <laughs> Take a, a few win. more times, yeah. some playoff games coming up after that. that but yeah, we're excited for that. Ice. And we can buy these too, of course, if we're not one of the first 750. Uh, now you no. got to be there first early. First come, first serve. Got to be there early. Well, 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 well. <laughs> got to get there early. <laughs> Talk about some of the guys on your team. Where do most of them come from? Yeah, we have a we have a really healthy mix, right? We have uh, some guys that are Canadian. We have American players as well, and and even some Europeans. Um, you know, obviously Nikita Pavlichev has been a big part for us, and he's a he's a Russian-born player, a, a Big Ten champion at Penn State University. So, uh, guys from all around, and and you think back to guys like Max Zimmer, the the hometown American from from the small town of Medina, Minnesota and uh, you know just a great kid out of, out of Wisconsin, Liam Pecoraro, a Boston mm -hmm. kid. So uh, we have a lot of great guys on this team from from all over North America, even into Europe and, and their personalities are, are even bigger than, than their play on the ice. It's yeah. a great group of guys to be around. I feel like once y'all awesome. got here more youth hockey has come about. You know, I've seen a lot of those kids in my neighborhood. They're like, oh, yeah, we're doing hockey. I'm like, that is amazing because, you know, down south, that's not always a big thing for mm. younger. Yeah, you're exactly right. And that's one of the things that, that we take pride in is, mm. is being entrenched in the community. We want to be a community first organization and a hockey team, right? Yeah. Everybody, everybody looks at a sports organization and says, that's what you do, right? You're in the business yeah. of sports. But being part of the community, being part of raising awareness and bringing people to the game and it, and it starts with fans right mm -hmm. it, you don't get to get into playing hockey and your kids don't start playing hockey if you don't first yeah. experience the thrill of going to a hockey game and that's that's one of the great things that we have to offer i know some of the hometowns of those guys were like minnesota canada of course right and michigan so again a lot of them have come down south to play yeah, and they all love it. One of the first things you ask them is, is why, you know, why come to Greenville? Why did you sign in Greenville? And, and they sit there and they go, why not? I mean, the they, love this, they love this place, right? <laughs> we want to be on ice, but we don't want to be in the ice <laughs> every day. So, guys, go tomorrow night. What time is the game? 7.05. 7 7 
Tomorrow night's the first one for a three game home stretch. Let's go support them on and get that playoff mm -hmm. win. So, Mark, thank you so much. Absolutely. Thank you for having me. Appreciate it. Very N cool. Number one swamp rabbit, right? Yeah. <laughs>